So welcome to day two of us in Zurich. When we woke up this morning, we found that our phone charger, our one phone charger that we brought from Munich was broken. Somehow I had fallen asleep on it and it broke inside my phone. Anyways, my phone's fine, but we need to get up and uh, go get a new phone charger before our tour in about an hour and a half. So let's go see if we can find your phone charger. a phone charger we paid way too much money for it but we had to do it because otherwise we don't have phones that work so now we're gonna go try to um, run some errands before our tour starts Crosswalks here are very confusing. They're not exactly clear, but you just kind of have to walk across and uh, you have the right of way. We made it though. It started raining just in time for our tour to start. So uh, might get a little wet on the tour, but that's okay. We won't melt. So time to go see what this tour is about. Point sixty four meters from this. Thank 
from scent earlier. So this one is just, let's go and see what happens. to do that tour of Zurich. Um, Samantha was an amazing guide. She knew all these random little facts about Zurich and she was able to get like these keys that get you into like special areas and into like the Roman ruins underneath the Freemasons place. And it was just, it was really cool to hear about all the different parts and see the different parts of the city. So now we're gonna head over and get some food at a Swiss place that Samantha recommended. It's called, uh, you hand it tour or something? I don't know. I'll show you when we get there. So we are back in the area we were in last night. Apparently, and the bar we went to is down there. And uh, looks about the same. good food. Uh, mine was a little bit too spicy for, for my liking. It wasn't bad, it was just unexpectedly spicy for some spaghetti. Um, now we are going to find a copy or a print shop nearby because we need to print out our tickets for our concert that we're going to on Sunday. One thing that Samantha did tell us was that in Zurich, or at least in Switzerland, trams have right-of-way over pedestrians and they will get very mad at you apparently if you get in front of them. closet or the bathroom they just used was the weirdest thing ever they had jets on the ground to clean the floor and uh, there were a whole bunch of buttons on the side that I was scared to push because I didn't know what different uh, buttons meant but in the toilet paper was super nice for a public bathroom but uh, overall pretty good pretty good bathroom <laughs> that's where day two is going to end. I hope you enjoyed the random adventures we went on today. Tomorrow's trip should be even more fun. We get up pretty early in the morning, but we're apparently going to the top of some mountain nearby. So that'll be pretty cool, but I'm gonna wrap it up. There may be a couple other random clips from tonight, but 
we're just gonna kind of take it easy and uh, get some sleep. So catch you later. Burger, best burger I've had in Europe so far.